Okay, so for today we are going to work on the cube, cube method for solving word problems. Our particular word problem that we're looking at is Josh put $45 in a savings account. If he saves an additional $10 each week, the equation 10w equals 175 minus 45 represents how long it will take him to save $175. How many weeks will it take? This equation, or this problem that we're working on, is very in-depth. It has a lot of information in it. So what we're going to do is we're going to use this cube method to find the important information that we need. So first things first, we need to circle all the numbers in the equation. So we have $45, $10, 10w equals 75 minus 45, and 175. The next part of this information is we need to underline the important info. So it says he put $45 in a savings account. I'm going to underline the word put because that tells me that I might need to do some sort of addition or subtraction or something like that. Then if he saves an additional $10 each week, that is also important information. We have the equation and we need to know how long, or this all represents how long it will take him to save $175. Then it says, how many weeks will it take? That's the next part. So the next part, we need to box the answer, box the question, actually, that should say. I'm going to cross that out and say question. We need to box the question. How many weeks will it take? That's the information we need. Everything else, we get to eliminate. We get to cross everything else. So we get to cross out Josh. You don't matter. Sorry, buddy. Savings account. If he saves an additional equation, represents how long it will take him to save and how many. We can erase all of that. So essentially what we are left with is $45, $10 per week, the equation 10 10 W equals 175 minus 45 and 175. We need to figure out how many weeks it'll take. So if we look at this equation, we have the situation. Let's see if I can make this a little smaller so we can see everything. Okay. So we have this equation right here, and I'm going to rewrite it as 10 W equals 175 minus 45. Let's do this work right here because we know we can do that. We still have our 10w on one side, 175 minus 45, that's going to get me 130. After that I have 10w is equal to 130. We're going to need to do a little multiplication or division right there and we got w is equal to 13. That's how many weeks it's going to take. Another way we can think about this is we need to, we have 10 times what number is going to be 130. And we know that 13 can fit in there pretty darn easily. So 13 weeks will be our answer. And that is how we use the cube method. I want you to now work on your worksheet and work and use the cube method to solve the remaining problems. Thank you.